Hello and welcome to a new series on the channel. So this series will be, as you can see, Grand Theft Auto Vice City, which is a sequel to Grand Theft Auto 3. And uh, different than the last series for GTA 3, I haven't played uh, Vice City before recording, so uh, I might not remember everything correctly. Well, apart from what I remember that there was uh, the RC chopper mission that was hard, but other than that, uh, I'll be pr playing, let's say, relatively fresh. Tommy Vassetti? <laughs> Shit! Then they'd never let him out. He kept his head down. Helps people forget. People will remember soon enough. When they see him walking down the streets of their neighborhoods, it will be bad for business. Well, what are we gonna do, Sonny? We treat him like an old friend and keep him busy out of town, okay? We've been talking about expanding down south, right? Vice City is 24 karat gold these days. The Colombians, the Mexicans, hell, even those Cuban refugees are cutting themselves a piece of some nice action. But it's all drugs, Sonny. None of the families will touch that shit. Times are changing. The families can't keep their backs turned while our enemies reap the rewards. So, we send someone down to do the dirty work for us and cut ourselves a nice quiet slice, okay? Who's our contact down there? Ken Rosenberg, schmuck of a lawyer. How's he gonna hold Vercetti's leash? We don't need him to. We just set him loose in Vice City. We give him a little cash to get started, okay? Give it a few months. Then we go down, pay him a little visit, right? See how he's doing. Hey, hey, guys, it's uh, Ken Rosenberg here. Hey, 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 great, hey. Well, uh, I'm going to drive you guys to the meet, okay? Now, I've talked to the suppliers, and they are very uh, keen to start a business relationship. So uh, if all goes well, we should... Uh, be doing very nicely for ourselves, which is, you know, good. Okay, so they're brothers, okay? One operates the uh, the business, and the other one does the plot. Okay, that's them and the chopper. All right, here's the deal. They want a straight exchange on open ground. All right? Okay, stay tight, let's go. Got it? 100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens? 10s and 20s, used. I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> oh, shit! I poked my head out of the gutter for one freaking second and fate shoveled shit in my face. Go get some sleep. What are you gonna do? I'll drop by your office tomorrow and we can start sorting this mess out. Okay, so... Uh, I guess uh, there was a drug deal that went wrong. And uh, two of our, of our friends uh, died. And one of the other guys. Okay, so I need to go uh, to the pink blip door. So big. That one's hot like leather seats on a hundred degree day. We interrupt your programming with a message from the State Department. All bridges and some roads in the Vice City metropolitan area have been closed because of a severe weather warning. Meteorologists are tracking Hurricane Hermione, which has devastated five Caribbean islands and is heading for Vice City. More updates soon. 
Okay, so I guess uh, uh, there's a map here also. So I guess we can't really uh, access any of the other islands uh, because there are there is a storm coming, and uh, not, I'm not sure why. Okay, I'm not sure. Okay. Move. I'm not sure why uh, the mouse wasn't working there, but uh, yeah, sure. Okay, and I need to go inside. Do I know you? I can pretty much save. Let's see. Hello, Sonny. Tommy! Tommy, it's been too long. <sighs> I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Fifteen years. Seems like only yesterday. I guess that's a perspective thing. Hey, doing time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own, okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee are dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy! Tell me you still got the money. No, Sonny. I don't have the money. That was my money, Tommy! My money! You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with! Wait, Sonny! You have my personal assurance that I'm gonna get you your money back, and the drugs, and I'm gonna mail you the dicks of those responsible. Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already. But because it's you, because we got history, I'm gonna let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch. Okay, so I guess we're owing Sammy some money. Okay, and let's go to Rosenberg, Ken Rosenberg. And I sent some advice to help keep things hot in the bedroom. Take a longboat and 20 of your finest men. Head to where the sun sets. There you will find the village. Pillage! Plunder and burn all that you find. And if you order now, you'll receive Thor's subliminal tape series. So you gain wisdom of the gods while sleeping. Except the crystal cup. At the feast, beware the dwarf. Thor's personal Norse power program. Call now. 866-PILLAGE. That's 866-PILLAGE. Hi, I'm BJ. Okay, and now let's visit our friend Ken Rosenberg. Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. These gorillas, listen to me, are going to come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous i did not go to law school for this okay now what the hell are we gonna do shut up sit down relax i'll tell you what we're gonna do you're gonna find out who took our cocaine and then we're gonna kill them that's a good idea that's a great idea let me think let me think let me think oh there's this retired colonel colonel juan garcia cortez He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht, and all of Vice City's big players are going to be there, okay? I have an invite. Of course I have an invite. But there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door. No I way. I told not you, happen. shut up. I'll go myself. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, I like 1978 too, but you know, this isn't going to be a beer at strippers do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here. Stop by Raphael's. Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go. Come on. Who's that guy think he is? Now I gotta dress like a chump as well as hang out with them? I like this shirt. Yeah, so I guess uh, we need to find some other clothes. That's Raphael's. Get your 
yourself some tea and me. And if you're listening out there, Shabon, you best let old lady killer out of the dog. Let's see what Raphael got for us. I'm guessing I need to steal the, his bike since the... No, the, my bike! Uh, no, this is my bike, I'm sorry. Of of course. Okay, this should be an entrance somewhere here. the party here Buenas noches I understand you are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or uh, mental well-being Mr. Rossetti He's just got a touch of agoraphobia <laughs> Excellent, excellent And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, it's an unfortunate set of circumstances for all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry, but such a delicate matter will take time. Perhaps we'll talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you to my daughter. Miss Davis! Karamia, could you look after our guest while I attend to my necessary obligations? Of course, Daddy. Please, excuse me. Mercedes? You try living with it. Anyway, let me point out some of our more distinguished guests. That's our congressman, Alex Shrub, with rising silicone star, Candy Sucks. And have you met my lovely wife, Laura? No? Well, uh, unfortunately, she's in Alabama. This is Candy. And over there, we have the Vice City Mamba's star titan, PJ. Always the charmer. I blocked down on him, and then I put him in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Well, now, I'm looking at some prime... And risk. that poolside amphibian is Jez Torrent, lead singer with Love Fest. Yeah, can I tell you, do you know how they play ping pong? It's silent. Let me tell you. It does not involve a paddle, <laughs> if you know what. Impotent. And the chatty trio, that sleeping sweat gland is Papa's right-hand gimp, Gonzalez. And the other two are Pastor Richards and pseudo-intellectual film director Steve Scott. The of passion with the Nippo invaders when the giant shark comes in and just bites their dicks off. Ah, now, you never saw anything like that before. Colonel, your party's as ever a triumph. <laughs> I can only apologize. Well, then another day. amigo. How do we find you? <laughs> Our business is very tried. Barbarians at the gate. A time for rewarding one's friends and liquidating one's enemies, amigo. Who's the loudmouth? Ricardo Diaz, he's Mr. Cope. Mercedes! Oh, I was just taking my friend back into town. Another time, Ricardo. Ricardo, let's go Let's get there. out of here. Actually, take me to the pole position. Drinks. Okay, so I guess uh, we've uh, found out more about the big players in Vice City. for my father? Maybe. You mind me resting my hand in your lap? Maybe. It's so difficult having a rich and powerful father. Vamos. Okay. And we're at the pole position. Around, Club. I'm sure you will. And I guess we've got hundred dollars for for that mission and the street outfit. I think I like the shirt better than than this. So yeah. Let me just change into something else, something more comfortable. Yeah, comfortable. And 
Yeah, I like this shot better. Okay. Oh. Give me a save. And I guess we still have a uh, time for another mission. I'm not sure why sometimes the mouse doesn't work, but yeah. Ah, well, I hope you're having a good time, because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it. Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slime ball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, all right? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Take it easy now. To find Where'd this you this guy? come up from? I've been looking for a bird like you for ages, mate. You know I'm looking am, for some mate. English guy. Kent Paul. Kent Paul, mate. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. You know what I mean? I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about a thing, mate. Get lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. I'm Kent Paul. I'm a friend of Rosenberg's. Rosenberg. Rosenberg. Oh, that bonkers ambulance chaser. That guy could defend an innocent man all the way to death row. <laughs> Get another drink, bruv. Everybody's a comedian. Listen to me. I'm missing 20 keys and a lot of cash. Drugs, mate? It's a mugs game. What do you know about it? Oi, oi, well, what I was coming to was, there's some chef come trumpet shifter who deals that kitchen of Hotel and Ocean Drive. He's been looking real pleased with himself lately. You could go and check him out. I will. And I'll be seeing you around. Yeah, that's right, go and walk away, you mug. I knock you spark out. Give me a drink. And where's that slut? Uh, that's a nice guy, let's say. Okay, and Holmes, Florida does not want you. Please die somewhere else. What's wrong with Nevada? Go to the Kansas. Chat we that was want a river. We need a river. The himself. Freedom River. And what about the other Please, crimes? Sir, it seems car crime, fashion crime, drugs, everything is on the rise. Absolutely. Of course. Hey, what you looking at? You better start talking. Hey, make me, you prick. Oh, you dick. Oh, way to go, tough guy. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some too? Hey, chill. I want what you want, brother. Oh, yeah? And what's that? Your green and my dead brother's white lady. Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. Well, no need to go all long range on my ass. The way I see it, we two hombres in a strange town. We need to watch each other's backs. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Here, take this. Follow me. This way! I just, uh... Yeah, this is Ben, 90, in Central. 
Washington Beach. And yeah, let's go. Alright. I need to drive his car, I guess. One thing you gotta realize about this town, you gotta pack some heat. The local gun shops a couple of blocks away. Yes, and let's go to ammunition. As always, per perfect driving. I guess I didn't need to buy any weapon. So let's go back to the hotel and uh, and finish the mission. I'm gonna go see what I can dig up. I'll be watching you, Tom. Okay, and I guess uh, this will be it for this episode, so yeah, introduction to Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Uh, I hope I'll see you again next time in the next episode. Bye!